morning everybody like i said on my previous video and this is the same day it's just later in i just want to make another video a different video to do the my entry into the pathfinder phase one part three the fire pit uh video or response and i say i'm staying with my camp and uh, i'll just show you a few things about my fire pit i have brought some bricks back in here to, to be able to put up a, a grill grate this grill grate i actually found back over there where i showed y'all the uh the electric pedestal from the old trailer park so junk does come in handy and i reckon that's that's one of the things they do teach at pathfinder you know be res be resourceful and if you notice on my uh fire reflector right there i got some poles those also i scrounged from from this area back in here where this trailer park was at though originally i just had the four uh the four uh uh pine posts down in the ground and uh and then I found them poles and I brought a hacksaw down in here with me one day and I cut them ha cut them poles up that was actually uh, two poles and I cut them they're down in the ground probably about three foot <laughs> so they're not gonna come out and all I have to do is replace the the logs if I have to and of course I keep five gallons of water right there just just mainly for uh, going and getting water out of the refrigerator or out of out of the refrigerator boy don't we wish we had a refrigerator out here during the summertime no i meant out of the river and uh well you'll see that the the rope's still tied to it and uh let me see of course i got my tripod over there my cooking tripod and uh i only dug down probably about i reckon six inches eight inches and stuff I don't burn too much back in here because I don't really want to give away my position. I do do when I come back in here. I do cook, and but for a little bit of amount of time, I'm going to be back in here, you know, to make coffee. You know, it's just as easy to get the transia out. And let me see if I can kind of show you. I've got this fire pit, uh, about two good steps. Let me see, about one about two good steps away from my actual bed and uh, if I have to you know I could always drop a, a clear sheet right there and it put out a little bit of little bit of heat you know for a super shelter though back you know I really don't need no super shelter because most coldest it gets is probably tomorrow night is supposed to be 14 degrees and that's the coldest I think we'll we'll get it uh, this the whole year but uh, yeah and Anyway, I do move the bucket away from the fire pit whenever I I burn, but I, I have it handy so that way I can throw some water on it if I have to. You notice also I keep my coffee grounds. The reason why I keep my coffee grounds, if you talk about hobo coffee, you could actually let them let them coffee grounds, even though they're sitting out in the weather, you could let them coffee grounds soak probably for probably 45 minutes an hour and you'll have a cup of coffee it may not be the strongest in the world but you'll have coffee that's the reason why i keep my coffee bags out here i don't never take them back to the house with me and that's what you call real hobo coffee there <laughs> okay now i haven't gotten that cheap yet where i where i keep reusing the the old coffee bags however i do 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 use them bags them bags be used for at least two more cups of coffee anyway of course I do have a little poker here that I use to stoke the stoke the fire up and plus also it's got a yoke so that way I can put a, a pot hang a pot over instead of using a tripod most of the time I just use a tripod okay hope y'all enjoyed this one and the next one will be uh, I reckon uh, navigation or direction rather uh, primitive primitive uh, direction using the shadow tip method i am going to do a shadow tip but uh i'm going to get around to doing the david canterbury's uh idea with the board the navigation board i thought that was really neat plus i can leave that right here in my camp all the time but uh i'm gonna take you on further out to about the middle of where the clear cut was it's it's pretty clear out there and got plenty of sunshine anyway see you in the next one which will probably only be about a half an hour from now I'm going to drink my coffee and enjoy myself for a second. Okay, take care. Bye.